guys welcome back to my channel Remy Jade astrology and today we are going to be talking about the Sun sign Aquarius people with their Sun in Aquarius don't mind my hair blowing I do have my fan on because it's super hot and I know I usually have my hair down but I don't want to be like super sweaty in this video it's been hot where I'm at um, so Let's talk about the people who have their sun in Aquarius. Long awaited video. So those who have their sun in Aquarius, these are very, very cold people. Like dead cold. <laughs> um, when I mean cold, they don't have any emotions. I'm just kidding. They kind of have emotions, but we'll get there. So the people who have their sun in Aquarius are those who know it all, or they think they know it all. Um, these people are not like Leo people where when they say I'm right, it's because they just think they're right. These people say they're right and they can back it up with facts. Ah, I don't want this to be distracting. So, um, yes, and they know a lot about everything. When I talk about them being cold, they're not really those type of people who like to express their emotions by saying I love you or anything like that. You just have to know it and be okay with that. They are not the most lovey-dovey lovey sort of people. They generally just like to articulate and talk about different ideas um, and they're very methodical. They like to talk about everything not like Gemini where they just talk just to talk. They actually want to hear other people's ideas. Uh, they like to exchange um, ideas. These people might seem like they have a lot of friends and there might be a lot of people who might consider Aquarius people their friends. But really though, Aquarius people, no, they don't really have a lot of friends. They might make you feel like they're you're their friend, but no they probably only have like one or two um they just make people around them comfortable and they make people around them feel like they're being understood when in general they just they're just there and they just want to you know just be with the company of people they like to exchange ideas that doesn't mean that you're their friend um when it comes to <laughs> i know that sucks um but it's okay you can think that way um when it comes to getting into relationships with Aquarius people, it is very hard to just get it on with them or have them like you. Um, first, you have to be smart or know a lot of things. You can't be illiterate. They do not like dumb people or people who are like, we're in the United States of America. No, uh, you need to know where you're at. Simple facts you have to like get. They do not like dumb people. Um, they also, uh, in order to get with them, you have to be their friend first. So if you go up to them and be like, hey, I like you, they're gonna be like, first of all, I don't know you. Second of all, um, I don't know even what you like. They have to have that camaraderie first before they start to be attracted to you. So an Aquarius is not gonna be that type of person to go up to you at a bar. Um, they are gonna be the type of person, if you were to get with them or um, yeah, just get with them, be in a relationship with them. Somebody has to introduce you, uh, if you've known them for a while, stuff like that. Um, but they can be like one night stand type of people and have no feelings. They can like not have feelings and emotions because um, they are an air sign. They're not a water or earth where, you know, there's like deep emotions. Air, it's all about, you have to get them mentally uh, stimulated before you can get their heart um, also with those who are Aquarius uh, Sun um, they are stubborn and and they like to get their way if they can't get their way they're just not gonna deal with you they're not gonna be mad about it they're gonna be like oh you're right okay yeah you're right but in their head like no you're dumb <laughs> I'm right um, although they might not tell you when they do exchange words though, sometimes it's tactless and sometimes it can hurt other people's feelings. Where um, you just, when you talk to an Aquarius, they just come off strong, sometimes with an attitude, but it's just they mean what they say and you just have to have thick skin around them and not take anything too personal. They do make a lot of friends and they are witty and funny, so it's not 
too hard to dislike an Aquarius and amongst friends they are the first ones that you would probably want to get to know to get to know not because they're mysterious or anything it's just they make you feel comfortable um, yeah so these are the Aquarius type of people when it comes to sex um, or in the bedroom hmm these people are up for a challenge and they like spicing it up in the bedroom they are all about being different and weird so they probably might use toys or bring up some type of contraption or whatever or whatever they seem before hey you want to try it out or and they wouldn't mind if you initiate it either um, <laughs> very adventurous in that sense oh by the way they do not want to be called normal not like mentally but like they want to be weird special in their own way if you tell them oh um, usually people do it this way these people are gonna be like oh usually people do it this way really okay well then I'm gonna do it this way and it's gonna be better uh, they do not take orders very well they kind of you know are a fixed air sign out of the three air signs this is a fixed sign the three air signs are Libra Gemini and um, Aquarius so they want to be different and if they want to be different they're gonna stick at it um, when I do my compatibility videos, which are coming up soon, I'll tell you which signs are most compatible with this sign. Um, so yeah, this is my general intake or outtake or whatever on those who have their sun in Aquarius. And if you like this video, please make sure to like, subscribe, comment below, and end request I will take. Um, so please comment below and thank you again for watching. Bye!